Hi folks, Akwaba. Today's edition we're going to talk about guppy breeding. Yes, guppy is like the hardiest fish in this hobby. Why is it, do I call it the hardiest fish? The survival rate for a new hobby is keeping guppy um, is 90%. Yes, this fish can survive under lots of conditions. Yes. Even uh, the imperfect conditions, guppies seem to survive. Today, what I'm going to do is that I'm going to talk a lot about the guppy and then also do a setup here to demonstrate how you can breed guppies. If you haven't subscribed yet, please hit the subscribe button down there now and then press the bell icon so that you'll be notified of all the amazing videos that I will be uploading. Guppies can be compared to rabbits. A female guppy under the right conditions, even the most worst conditions, can give birth every, and note this point, every 30 days. So in a year, you can have your female guppy giving birth to how many uh, fry in the whole of 365 days. Guppies tend to give birth between 30 to 50 and sometimes even more fry every batch so in a year one female can give you that much now let's look at guppies in this order guppies rapidly reach maturity since guppies give birth instead of laying eggs guppy fry that is the baby fish are born more developed than most fishes like the koi and the goldfishes guppies just swim start swimming immediately they are giving birth to guppies are giving birth to that's what we call life birth they're, they're unlike the koi the goldfishes that spawn these ones uh, give birth instead of laying eggs which we call spawning once a guppy is about two three months old she tends to start giving birth yes starts giving birth a female guppy under optimal conditions can give birth every 30 days like i said earlier on and each batch of fry can range between 20 to 50 guppies so we have a few factors here to consider in breeding our guppy we need to prevent the adults from eating our fry how do we do that we need to have a heavily planted aquarium also since most aquariums do have uh, water pumps that suck up um, the water and the dirt and goes through the filter you can't keep a water pump in your aquarium as you're breeding guppies there is a way you can go about it and i'm going to teach you in this edition let's go ahead right away and do the setup i have an air pump well sorry i have water pumping there which is pumping in the water and as it does that it pumps the dirt and everything from the water and then goes into the filter so we have the filter here here so the water drains but i'll bring you closer so you have a look so we always have a clean water yes although guppies can um, be in there even if without the pump but um, it helps in a way what it does is that aeration is taking care of um, uh, the, the tank is well cycled is very well cycled so the organisms and everything seems to work perfectly providing the right conditions for the guppies hence you're going to have healthy and uh, good uh, guppies yes what I'm going to use here as the artificial plants. I'm going to use the artificial plants here. And let's go right ahead. Let me turn this light down so it doesn't blind you guys. So we're going to use these. These are just normal aquarium plants. And this is what the fry will be hiding in. Our fry will mostly be hiding in these plants when the 
mother guppy gives birth when the mother guppy delivers yeah so very easy we'll drop this here yeah you gotta have enough plants um this will go to this corner let me take another one this entire will be enough I'm going to have it heavily, heavily planted so that um, the survival rate will be very, very, very high. Very high. Okay, so I'll bring you closer so you can have a look at it. As you can see, I have this uh, water pump in here. This is just a thousand liters per hour pump. And I have connected it to, um, to this sponge here so that the fry won't be able to suck up because the pump is not too powerful it's not going to suck up the fry yes you can uh, it's advisable to use the air pump with the uh, with a sponge filter so it pumps the water all the way up here there's an old aquarium i'm using here by the way we have the aquarium heavily planted these are just normal um these are just normal uh pebbles and then um, aquarium plants that are used yeah trying to get it out I'll, I'll probably do it later I'll let it sit in the rocks and then uh, that's it now let's go find our guppy and bring it here I have this female guppy here you can see a black spot right there and that indicates that that's called the gravity by the way and that indicates that the guppy this female guppy is heavily pregnant and it's about it's almost time to give birth that's the male guppy with the yeah i'm trying to that's the male guppy um we do have some fry in here we have about two of them that's one here yeah but what i'm going to do is that we're going to test the whole uh, process i'm only going to put in this female guppy for the next let's say three months and we're going to see how often this female guppy is going to give birth even without the male in there so let me get my um, net and then uh, get her out we have the guppy in the net that's the female guppy i'm trying to release it so you guys can see Um, yeah that's the that's the female gap and she's the only one going to be in here yes now we have the guppy in there she's not going to be bothered by any male she's going to be all alone in there no she's not going to be lonely she's, she's going to have some rest and then deliver her babies and I will update you guys when she does I'm hoping to catch her when she's doing so so you guys can see how they give birth to life babies live fry this cute aquarium here will surely go out for a subscriber this month i'm trying to uh, i'm going to start with the region in which i am so people who subscribe around will get some aquariums every month every month i'm giving out some there's an uh, there's a filter and there's the aquarium so that's it we'll be giving these out so follow us on instagram follow us on facebook subscribe to the channel hit the bell icon as well and there are lots of goodies for you thank you